Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can turn your old scrap cardboard boxes into this. Hey, I'm Mahan. I'm a student and I love making props from movie series and TV shows like this. And I'm going to teach you how to do it. So if you're new here, please don't hesitate to subscribe and follow my Instagram and YouTube channel for photos and videos and prop updates special events. So I'll see you there. And now, let's dive right into the video. The first thing that you do is cutting out the pieces listed below. And make sure that you fold the lines. Afterwards, cut out these four pieces and glue them together with an angle. Also, don't forget to apply more glue on the back of the hammer so it becomes stronger to have a result like this. So to make it less jiggly, cut out the rectangular pieces to make the structure strong. You can also fold them like this to make it thicker and more durable. To have a structure like this. Now cut out these 5 pieces and glue them with an angle. To have the head of the hammer formed like this. Then glue the headpiece on the open sides of the hammer. To have the primary head formed like this. Afterwards, cut a large rectangular piece and using a steel pipe, make it like a cylinder. Then close it up tightly to make the handle. You can also apply more glue at the bottom of the cylinder for more endurance. Now you can insert the cylinder into the head of the hammer and glue it there. Afterwards, cut a small slice of thin cardboard and glue it here. Then, place the paper template on the hammer and using a sharp needle, mark the lines to connect together with a pencil laser. Now using the blade, cut only the first layer of the cardboard so the template you drew is lower than the other parts. Then apply lots of wood glue so it's more durable. Don't hesitate to use your hands to spread the glue evenly. Then cut out these small pieces out of thin cardboard. And glue them to the handle at every 3 cm. to have a result like this. Now cut out these small pieces to fill in the gaps of the heads of the hammer. To have a result like this. Cut out these piece. Now glue it on the center of the hammer. Like this. 
Now using a mix of wood glue and water, tear some cardboard papers and soak them into the mixture and apply it on the hammer so it gives it cardboard texture. Then, using the strings you made with the cardboard paper, form them to a similar shape of the reference photo. To have a bold texture like this. Now for making the top of the hammer, cut the template and using a ruler, indicate the center of the circle and make a small hole in it with a sharp needle. In this step, you should use a caliper to identify where the text should be. Again, you should use the reference photos to illustrate the marks of the top part of the hammer. Then, to make it more realistic, use a high graphite pencil to bold the text. Like this. Once again, using ruler and pencil, draw the designs of the sides of the hammer. Now cut out these two pieces and glue them right here. Now using your sharp scissor, make notches and fold them inwards. Cut out these three pieces and glue them on top of each other that way. To make the handle, cut a long stripe of cardboard. Then damage the corrugation with a steel pipe so it becomes like leather. You also could use marker instead of a steel pipe. Then do the same coating process on these two parts as well. Then draw a line where the part of the grip goes inside the handle and using your blade, cut out these small rectangular pieces. Then glue the grip to the handle. My opinion is adding more glue to this part so it becomes strong. Finally, you can glue this small piece. 
for the handles decoration, add some cardboard paper strings to it and make marks that are included in the reference photos. To have a magnificent result like this. guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video don't forget to smash that like button subscribe and share this video with others or in your instagram don't forget to tag me uh, so i can share it in my story and if you like this video you should maybe should like these other videos uh, which are listed here i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time